The Spirit is a really good little grill. In this video, you'll learn all the Spirit's features, including their new smart grill, as well as a comparison between all the models. We'll also show you a few problems that may or may not impact your decision. Let's get started. First, the Spirit is designed for the outside in a way other competitively priced grills are not. Even the basic model, the grill is hard plastic, stainless, and a painted bottom to withstand the elements even in New England. But here it's important to understand there are two different Spirit grills, the Spirit and Spirit 2. Three years ago, they changed the internal components on the Spirit 2, dubbed the GS4. Let's briefly look at the GS4 improvements and what they look like on the grills for the Spirit and the Spirit 2. Weber added a second row of bars on the GS4 models to decrease flare-ups and centered and slope the grease collection so it flows more evenly. The older series has only one row of bars and the grease collection's on the side. It uses an older but still effective crossover ignition system. However, it is the less expensive 379 to 479 Spirit 2 grills with the GS4 improvements. The new and more featured Spirit grills, like even the Smart Grill, have the older system. Either way, Weber is one of the most reliable products sold at Yale, needing repair just 2% of the time. Many of the parts are warranty for up to 10 years as well. Let's look at the grills. All are available in, in propane, but only the E330 and S315 models are available in natural gas, and the Weber Spirit 2, the E310, is available in natural gas. The Weber Spirit 2 series is considered the entry-level model equipped with the either a two-burner or three-burner configuration. The E210 Spirit 2 is their base model. It offers 26,500 BTU through two burners with 360 square inches of cooking space. The Spirit, with the same model number, has the cabinet below for storage at 429, while the Spirit 2 is less expensive at 379 with the GS4 improvements. You also have to be careful because the Spirit and the Spirit 2 share the same model numbers. E310 adds another burner and more BTU at 32,000 with more cooking space at 424 square inches. Once again, the Spirit has the cabinet while the Spirit 2 has the newer system. S315 is the newest all stainless Spirit at 599 and will have the same specs as the E310 but adds the stainless steel flavorizer bars. Stainless won't chip like porcelain. However, it doesn't have the new ignition and grease management of the GS4. At 629, the E330 regular Spirit offers many high-end features like a 12,000 V2 side burner. It's convenient because now you don't have to run into your kitchen to cook your corn. You can cook and grill at the same time. You also have a 7500 B2 sear station in the middle of the grill. In this case, it's not a sear like an infrared, it's just an additional row of burners. The E330 is available in black only and has the porcelain flavorizer bars. The SP335 is the best spirit grill before you learn about their new smart grill. You have three burners in stainless with stainless flavorizer bars along with the sear station and the side burners. It doesn't have the new ignition and the grease management of the GS4. Weber's have been on the forefront of smart technology with their iGrill compatible systems. Weber's smart system operates through Bluetooth meat probes. The Hiron Lynx, as an example, operates through sensors only. It's a good system as you can see the temperature through an app on your phone receive text to flip your burger or when the food is done. Weber has recipe tie-ins as well. In terms of the grill, the Smart is similar to the SP335 in functionality with the side burners, sear, three burners, and stainless, just with the added Smart functionality in the digital readout on the grill itself. You can add the iGrill probe to any grill, but it doesn't display in the grill itself. Although Spirit does have a sear zone, it's just another row of burners. It will cook faster, but if you want those char marks on your food, it's not in the design. You cannot smoke or add flavor to a Spirit, but there really aren't any grills at that price with smoking capabilities. Spirit is a small grill as well. If you have a large family and like to entertain, then a four burner Genesis may be a better option. 
First, the Spirit is solidly built in stainless iron plastic. It will last longer than other comparable brands. So it's good value. Your upgrades are side burner, sear station, and the stainless exterior with stainless flavorizer bars and then the smart functionality. However, you have two grill types, really. You have to choose between a better, faster ignition and grease management system of the Spirit 2 and the GS4 improvements or the better features of the regular Spirit series. Just be careful when you buy because the model numbers are the same. If you want both features and the better system, you may want to consider their Genesis series starting at $749. The Spirit does offer a comprehensive line of affordable and durable grills. Click the link in the description below to download our free barbecue buying guide and to learn more about popular units with in-depth comparisons of all the most popular brands, answers to frequently asked questions, and buying strategies to save you money. Thanks for watching.